Hey, this is Chris. I just wanted to say that we recorded this before the Sonic Central and hands-on preview went on at IGN, since it seems like every time you blink, there's new details about this game. So if we're like, oh man, I wonder what's up with the plot. Uh, we know now that we got a little info yesterday, but uh, anyway, let's go. Hi, this is Chris Mekinis fan, and thanks to IGN and I guess Sega, we get to see the brand new Sonic game. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. I'm not here alone, but with me today, let me go into Discord. We have David the Lurker. Uh, oh, hello. We have Smoofies, Steven. Oh, oh, hello. <laughs> we have Games Enlisted, Stefan. There's only five of us. And we have Tabithan Almond, aka TJ. Metropolis Zone exists beneath the ocean. <laughs> no, 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 that, that, is, that, is, that is not correct. <laughs> oh, this footage proved it, David. Oh, right. <laughs> I can see it, actually, now. See, see those four purple coins from Odyssey? Those were crafted underwater in Metropolis Zone. Yeah, exactly. Right. Wait, see, David gets it. <laughs> What about the float? What about the floating, uh, scrapped Sonic level that you can see, like in the far distance there? Oh no! Look at that, man. That's a, you can see the level design, the intent, everything. That's a tease of what you're getting in this game. Oh, That's what you've been boy. waiting for. The, 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 the oh, test boy. level, I think. Um, they forgot to remove. It's a Tesla. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> they forgot to. They forgot it. to remove. That's back when when Sonic Frontiers, Must which is zone. called Sonic Front. Uh, <laughs> Sonic yes. Front. Yeah, yeah. So I guess to set it up, um, we've been. Waiting patiently for Sonic Team's next 3D Sonic game since, uh, when did Forces come out? November 2017? November? October? I don't know. Who November. cares? November. Yeah. So we finally saw a CG of this game about a year ago, and then last December we saw some more CG of this game and some little stuff, and now we're here. We're looking at the gameplay. Uh -huh. If my tab switched correctly, we also have some combat to look at. Did that switch correctly? Yeah, sure I see Sonic kicking. Yeah. Okay. I see, I see, I see punching. All right, December, we're doing it live. December yes. wasn't CG; those were environments that they showed us from the from the game footage, right? It was both. There was CG and some air quote gameplay, like environment pans. Yeah, and I think the reason why those environments look so empty is because you're supposed to unlock all these different things, like rails in the sky and stuff. Like you, you have to. You use your orbs or whatever that you collect, and you. You, you make them appear, and then you get to go collect more things. It's, right? bas it's basically just Bowser's Fury on a bigger scale. Yeah, Which That's sounds also, like, awesome to me. And it's in the sky. It does, but just like at the same time, like I'm just not... I, I'm just going to come out and say I did not care for this footage. Like, either the combat or this. You, you don't, and I, the aesthetic of you the don't whole do thing, this? just like... Huh? <laughs> You don't want to do this? Yeah, I don't, I don't want to do, do this. this. I mean, like, I'm sure I'll have fun for, like, a couple hours doing this. But just, like, aesthetically, like, I'm just not impressed. Wow. You know what I think is going to happen is the same thing that happened to me when I played uh, Forces. I turned the game on. I was like, I don't like this. And then I kept playing it. And then I 100 percent of it. And then you were also like, I still don't like this. <laughs> and then I thought, you know what? This isn't so bad. Oh. How many games? I just like I wish like I wish that Sega would just like play to their strengths. Maybe they are. Their strengths are right. I, just, right. I, I think like, the I just, problem like, is they do. Uh. <laughs> oh really? <laughs> <laughs> Go on. Oh no! I, well, you were making a point. I was rudely interrupting. I just mean like I'm just like really tired of just like this like realistic aesthetic with sonic like i realized that the last couple games or at least with forces like they tried to go back to your like green hills and your chemical plants and stuff like that but just like there are far more sonic like established like lo locales to like explore like why why can we not like flesh out the like genesis era sonic like in a in a 3D landscape. Well, because he's on a brand new island. Uh, what what is Starfall? Skyfall? 
That's that's a Bond movie. Uh, the Starfire the Islands. Bond. Right. <laughs> Sonic returning to his roots and exploring islands. Actually, this is as classic as it gets. That's DJ. right. Every island is yeah, meant to look I? different. Green Hill doesn't look like Emerald Hill, and Emerald Hill doesn't look like Angel Island Zone Act 1 or 2. <laughs> so, clearly... It is funny how... <laughs> Go on. People are complaining about, oh, I'm going to Grass World and Desert World, etc. And it's like, well, we gave you something new, and you don't like that either. <laughs> it, it, it's all, it's all, always goes back to Simpsons. You people don't know what you want because you're kids, because you're stupid. There it is. Oh, that was I like rude. those rails. I don't know where they go or what they do, but they're there. <laughs> Is it, like these it, little snake I bends. Think that's part of the issue, okay? Because if we're talking about level design. Like that's a that's a set piece up there. There's a little bit of design going on, but it doesn't. It's it's not just oh, it's not attached to anything. Well, I guess that is the problem. It's not. A, I love that bird. That's a good bird. Um, <laughs> bird's good. Bird. Everyone loves the I bird. Know. They should just replace the Sonic model with the bird. And Are you essentially getting at like what purpose does it serve? Well, because that's the problem that I have also. Yeah, because okay, so if this is an open world game everything's connected to everything else i mean things are going to open up things are going to unlock I, I get all that but um you know it should still feel kind of like somewhat cohesive um mm -hmm. where hey yeah there's that strange thing up there how do i get to it oh it'll lead me to something else but it is just here's some rails there's no clear beginning or end it doesn't seem to take you anywhere because even if it's, oh, you gotta unlock the thing it goes to, maybe the rails shouldn't be there until you unlock it, because otherwise it's just things floating above you. And that's not mm -hmm. something you see in Sonic. Well, the the first footage they show us of the game has nothing in it, so you probably unlock all this stuff and it shows up later. You probably look in the sky and there's collectibles and you're like, oh, how do I get that? And then the rails appear later and you're like, oh, I can get them now, yay. I, I so that I think touches with... Go ahead, Seven. Sorry. I think the big issue that people are kind of having with like like the the, the two gameplays that we've been shown is because is of how out of context they are. Like yeah. we have like we have mm -hmm. no like idea. Like we don't we don't know what how the progression works. We don't know yep. what exactly the goals are. It's like it's basically the, just looking at the two games like on their own. Basically, just look like like everybody made the joke the 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 Sega hire this man tech demo of just running through like an open and empty like unfinished like level of just being like oh this is how the gameplay works like you can run speed like past this big like large open area here are, like little sections where levels could be and it's like if we get if we had more of an idea of what exactly is going on in this world what do you have to do and being like yeah like everything is empty but you slowly unlock more and more stuff the more you do things then it'd be like okay yeah there's context there's like a thing of like oh i now i understand what's going on but the, because of we literally just have here's an empty here's an empty uh field run around in it and that's about it so all we think like just from this footage all we think of is going on in this game is just running around and and doing nothing i so, mean that's the thing like i don't think sega can afford to take that that kind of like risk like why are you going to put this out here if you know that people are going to make that like assumption like that this is like what the game is you know what i mean like they already have enough the, problems the guess i'll venture is that uh they weren't expecting this response i think they were thinking like oh man look how pretty our game looks it's a new thing they'll just eat it up and look at it and be excited but naturally yeah like speaking to my biggest issue with this footage like i'm not like crazy enthused about the game or whatever but like stefan was getting at like all these rail things up in the sky you probably generate those in unlocking something right like that's probably not just there so you would in theory unlock that and then go do the thing but us looking at this it just looks like a bunch of rails hanging around in the sky and you're like okay mm -hmm. and granted even after you do that then there's just a bunch of rails in the sky but you know like like like, like the, just, just the general like the general concept of this is like i, I just I, I straight up love just like yeah the idea of getting to play like sonic generations-esque like controlling sonic in a ginormous like open world and just running around like zooming doing some platforming so like just that concept alone is like yes that is exactly what i want like i want to do this it's just like what we've seen so far is just very yeah it's very out of context like, there are some things that be like oh i can see how that's cool i can see how that is cool but yeah we, we just haven't seen it it's, it's not a thing of our where i'm like again like the doom posting side of this looks trash and it's not going to be good <laughs> at all it's more so 
I need to see more to figure out what exactly is going on. Like, if I had to say, like, yeah. my, my biggest criticism so far of just the footage is that the frame rate seems to chug a lot, and there also seems to be a lot more pop in than there probably should be. There, so, but yeah, yeah but hope, springs on the right. Yeah, and then hopefully that's like that. Yeah, again, that, that that could hopefully be only just this tech demo problem that will be fixed uh, later on. But it's like at least if they're like in terms of game, like I think gameplay wise, I think it look it looks perfectly. Like the level design might be very weird, like right now, but I think like control. Like, again, it's hard to tell controls just by watching footage. But I think control-wise, this looks perfect for some. Interesting. Huh. A lot of positivity. I heard that this game is going to be worse than Sonic 06, Forces, and Boom Rise of Lyric combined. <laughs> <laughs> wow, who said that? The internet? Yeah. Was it oh, David? Oh, yeah, it was. Um, <laughs> it... Uh, See, like it could, it could be. Oh yeah, you know things will open up, new things will show, those reels will make sense. But there's also the the fear that 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 actually isn't how it works, and it's like what you see is what you get. And because here they show, you know, Sonic doing a thing, and then there's that weird uh, wave of scanning, and then an item shows up. It it would be better if the footage actually showed something appear. Like like a tower, like a thing well, that's not a. They're already hiding stuff from us. Like there's no HUD. Right, right there now. there we is don't... no HUD. Uh, the rings, man. I don't know if I like the way the rings go into Sonic. They look that looks really weird. Like <laughs> of all the things, <laughs> those rings are going in the wrong way. Well, I mean, <laughs> like they they. Where how should they be inserted in the Sonic? Um, <laughs> quickly and smoothly not like fly away from him and then go back in that's sort of mm. what they do like yeah. that loop you just saw they there's like a very distinct oh they gotta they gotta have a journey before sonic can eat it so i have uh, i guess i have something to like to ask you guys so like your positivity is somewhat like unfounded to me like at this point, like, Jesus. what has Sega, like, what has Sega done to... Your happiness is illogical. <laughs> but, like, what has Sega done to, like, convince you guys that, like, that, like, oh, you know, it'll be, it'll be better. Like, when it comes out, it'll be better. Like, what, what good faith have they earned? Oh, like, I've missed TJ on our channel. Okay, TJ, if we're going <laughs> off of a uh, previous track record, then yeah, I'm not excited. But if I'm going off of what I see, then I am. Hmm. That's fair. I like I I just like to be generally optimistic like, like about literally and about literally anything. It's like no matter if I have like good faith in something or not because it, if it ends up being good then it's like oh yeah then I, w I was right. I get to be more happy. If it ends up being not good then I'm like oh well eh, wow. and then move on. Like I I'd, I'd rather I'd rather spend more of my time being like interested and excited than just being cynical and annoyed the entire time. How dare uh, you. I have something uh this okay so mm -hmm. we are we are basing our judgments on the entire game just on this one tutorial level because like there's gonna be four islands so the, f the first one's just gonna introduce you to stuff yeah. right i mean this might not even be the proper so, first island it could mm -hmm. be island zero although uh, although, yeah. remember, not a although remember when everyone was like oh the city level in forces is gonna be the first level <sighs> and it was the halfway point <laughs> yeah. so more to like what we're getting at though like there's this massive land over here and like when we're on that tower you can see another massive land like maybe out there or it's this one but like you know i was talking about it with steven i think in our dms or in the group dm or something but like this could be air quote island one but it could be a string of islands right so like this might be the first area of an island and then you just zip across the water to like a different island and it's more complex over there again we have no idea because they haven't said anything but right. There's not. It's like Stephen mapped this island out, which was very cool, by the way. And like, uh, it's pretty you can big, show that but now like, if you want. I don't have it pulled up. <laughs> oh no! Oh, in I'll... editing. Oh, <laughs> in post. I thought you meant for us to look at. Yeah, there <laughs> no. it is. Whoa, hey, that's a great that. map. I love it. <laughs> I love, no, it's I love not. Map. I love maps. I didn't realize that this game was good until I saw your map. Now I know it's good. Oh, uh, it's good now. You see, you see now. You see. <laughs> I do. I do. Oh man, I. Yeah, but like in terms heights? of this being the tutorial island, yeah. like it can still be island one, but air quote islands, you know what I mean? Yeah. I'm hoping because I want to run across the water over to other islands and do stuff. They describe it as islands. Right. There yeah. there are, I mean, like 
the the uh, the initial batch of screenshots that we got, which had did not have Sonic Over in there. Uh, th there seems to be a little variety in terms of, of visual, right? Like different colored grass or something. Oh, go back a little bit. See that island right? Um, oh, uh, press play. That one there. No, oh, keep going. Press okay. play and pause. That oh. one. Do you know how to? You can press comma to go back by frames. Ooh, on your keyboard. Man, you're, you're talking about YouTube hacks. Put up the YouTube hack logo. Uh, Yo. Anyway, that that island over there, you can actually go on. There's uh, there's grind rails on that island out there. Oh. oh. So that's like a little mini one next to this one. That's exactly what I was hoping to hear. Yeah. So you can travel to other big islands like that. Probably via a big grind rail just takes you. He, he like. <laughs> <laughs> I want to run across the water. I want to do uh, a boost and, you know, dodge some stuff on the way there. I or want something. to awkwardly climb but, like that. Um, yeah, that that was the only part of this trailer that I was like, no, <laughs> no climbing. Why, why did you keep that footage in? To have redone I this? don't know why there was. I mean, look, I don't want to like cherry pick this too hard, right? Even though like this is what they've given us to analyze for months or whatever. But like, there's a dash pad that gets them up. I think it's safe to say the person playing let go of something or just lightly holding up so yeah. like there is an option to climb mm -hmm. why would you do that when you can just walk up at a reasonable pace still uh, there's a lot of walking <laughs> in this trailer like you when you think about sonic you don't think of him just walking around i remember one of the big complaints yeah. of lost world is that they gave him a run button or at least that's one of my big complaints of lost world uh that, that, yeah. that, that, that is also just a thing about a lot of like, I mean, like pro quote unquote professional gameplay footage where they're like, oh, we want to show off the world, so we're not There's really playing it exactly how you're supposed to. So you just yeah, so 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 you're just kind of slowly walking in a circle just to be like, yeah. oh, look at this place. See, look, so you're doing like the cinematic the stuff or whatever. Wild. Yeah. Like, <laughs> I just I can't get over the they're too wild. Wah 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 wah. See, look at that. Wah wah wah. It's wah. cool. I like it. I mean, I don't think that's, that that can't be the final product for that. Oh, I think it is. I, I, we we gotta okay. We gotta talk about okay. So this game is meant to come out holiday of this year. There isn't a lot of time. Mm. It's June. Holiday could no. be November, December. I mean, Sonic, like we said, Forces came out in November, right? Whoa! Wait a minute. Did he, did he just turn? Did he just jump left and then go to the right? Yeah, that's been a thing people have been uh. pointing out. <laughs> <laughs> Games ruined. Right. I, I hashtag delay Sonic Frontier. And one of those months, David will be used for printing and shipping. Yeah, I mean, I'm, so we have less. I'm than sure that. there will be a day one patch. Uh, if you only play what's on the <laughs> disc, it's just going to be this map and nothing ever unlocks. I believe. It's, David, yes. can I present you with a game theory on your ring? Oh issue? man, a game theory for a ring theory. Oh, yeah, HUD? if we're just like really going okay, in let's here, go in. you know how Unleashed the rings fly into the ring gauge and fill it up instead of yeah. flying into oh, Sonic? Yeah, that does happen, doesn't that? I, I wonder if it's something like that, where like that's why they're so sporadic. They're just like flying into a HUD element that they hid for some reason? Maybe. Um, I've... Granted, they're not going very far if they are, but no, it... you know, there's a lot of things you gotta like counterbalance here. Like, well, maybe that's going on. Right. Um... Yeah, there might be something else going on with the rings, and the and this demo doesn't know what to do with the ring. But man, that just popped up. Yeah. Yeah, and, the, and there, there there was that more pop in that was just kind of like eh. there's a lot of pop in, uh, which we don't. I don't think we know what platform this footage is coming from. Uh, you know, if this is like the Switch mm -hmm. version, then I guess you can shrug and go, "Well, that's the Switch." Um, <laughs> Uh, yeah. But if this is like the PlayStation Five, ooh, no. Yeah, how th this can't be like. I feel like if this is a Switch, then it'd be like, okay, yeah, I can kind of understand. But this is a PS Five. Like, what are you doing? Right. But how we, did you do this? We don't know. Um, I I mean, there's the impression that Sega just sent this footage to IGN, right? Like, all the comments from people who work at IGN are like, we didn't. Look, I didn't record this footage. Did you? No, I didn't record this footage. Um. <laughs> Yeah, some guy straight up said, like, he's the one previewing or whatever, but he wasn't allowed to record, which makes sense, right? You know, that happens, right? But makes you wonder, what the Th heck? That would mean that <laughs> this is Sega going, oh, we're putting our best foot forward, which... <sighs> no, they didn't. No. <laughs> yeah, it, it is kind of funny to think that they probably were like, oh, like, we, we don't want to have, like, 
a journalist quote unquote doing like playing the game wrong and like making it look bad so we're gonna do it ourselves and then oops oops <laughs> and they're like wait a minute we also don't know how to show off this game we only see it from like the from the point of view of like beta testers so it's like oops we don't know how to show off either we were talking about the pop in not to just like fucking cherry pick dive on this game but you can see mm -hmm. the pop in come in and like where how far it's loading from here oh the grass which, like, yeah for most games no issue but like in an open world fast game this kind of stuff sticks out more like that won't bother everyone right but when they're like hey man look at this environment and how pretty it is we're gonna walk and show it off you start looking at it going like huh oh, okay right. yeah because it now yeah. i do want to real quick because we only have tj for a little bit no tj Okay. Oh yeah, I was gonna no, ask no, no, not, TJ, I'm, I'm not, what are your last allowed, words? I'm not allowed to talk before your public execution. <laughs> <laughs> you negative Nancy. I'm not allowed to what talk because I don't have combat? positive opinions about Sonic. <laughs> well, TJ, you're the voice of every other Sonic fan on the internet right now. You got to speak up for your people. <laughs> well, here's you know, I'm glad I'm glad that you switched to the 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 combat footage because. I just don't understand what the fuck. Like <laughs> what? Are, like oh, what? Yeah. <laughs> Why you don't want to do this? What what is he? Why do you, why do you keep asking if I want to do this? Like, you, you, I, I'm just asking. Like, you don't want to do this. This is oh, fun to you. You don't want to. You don't want to spend like a minute doing this. I guess I, <laughs> the animations are like really causing me some issues. Like when he does the super moves, like what the fuck is he doing? Like how does he like just like he just like well, blinks like away from the enemy. There's Sonic. He's slowly running because it's slowed down. Oh, he jumped. He's in a ball, but now he's no longer Chaos in Chaos Blast! See? I like that. I do something. like that move. I like that move a lot. That Actually, no, he, he's, he's using Chaos Punishment. That's what he... Yeah. Oh, but now he's hitting nothing? He's hitting, like, in front of the ball. <laughs> he's got, like, a force field, maybe. You know, it's AI. It's a cyberspace element, right, if you will. Right, but wasn't it hitting the other balls? So, like, it kept on hitting where the old balls <laughs> were. I'm gonna keep on saying balls. Um, let me balls. see. I think it's like when he's fighting this thing. Let me let me see what. Yeah. I... Are you talking about the one where it just awkwardly, jankily cuts to him being far away, and then he like dives in? Yeah, it's like he does this whenever he does the super moves. Like it, it it's just he like just like blinks. And uh, the enemy is combined with the music just gives me huge Kingdom Hearts like. Thing, like things like I see music these. was edited in right yeah there's some yeah like I, 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 yeah like i'm pretty sure i'm pretty sure uh, uh otani said that none of this music there's also just like but just just the music and choice that they did in general but yeah it sounds it sounds very like has that kingdom hearts like slow piano and then combined with these guys which just which just look like which look like they, they look like uh the the uh, the uh, data n uh nobody from like coded right. so it's like yeah just okay weird. never mind i saw it there i guess he kind of like he does like actually zip away. Yeah. But there is, it is very there is hard to a, see. I did not notice it until this time. There is a <laughs> move where he just like blinks like away to do the move. And it's just like it just doesn't make any what? sense. Whoa. Like, why did he Whoa. he's like, Oh, I'm gonna punch you, but then I'm gonna leave. Oh, I forgot I'm not done punching you. I better come back. That's the thing that gets me, like, it's this specific enemy that's the issue, so I get it. I fully I say this fully knowing that. But he has this big fancy fucking movie does mm. against this enemy, and there's like no impact just because it has well, a the enemy. Up. Yeah, it was blocking, <laughs> so so it just looks kind of like a dud, even though it should look pretty cool. There he goes. Cool. Oh, yeah. I guess yeah, I saw it that time too. Keep spinning. So right? my point is kind of irrelevant. Yeah, TJ, Team Hater doesn't even know what they're talking about. Exactly. Let's go, Positive Squad. <laughs> I mean, I kind of like the flower enemy. I just wish it looked a bit more like a flower instead of. Um... I wish it looked like a bad thing. Yeah. <laughs> well, these are ancient guardians, right? I don't know. Like, they can't be Eggman robots. Cyber enemies, maybe. Um, uh, I mean, yeah, I, 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 I don't. I, yeah, I'm pretty sure these are supposed to be like those things that, like, yeah, like those, those like cyberspace things. Like, they, they aren't Eggman creatures. Cybers. Maybe he's controlling them. Maybe he hacked into oh. the mainframe. But, yeah, we don't or, get to yeah, know. either that, or, yeah, either that, or it's, it's like a, yeah, it's a combination of both. Where it's like, oh, he's like mechanically. I mean, like, look, like, look, look at like these guys though. Like these guys look totally like uh, heartless nobody thing. 
Yeah. Like King Horizon. <laughs> yeah, th those those are just random. Uh, I mean, if if we find out, oh no, Egg Eggman made them. The robots we swear. I'll be very confused about these fighting yeah, polygon team. And I guess I guess the flower guy <laughs> is <laughs> just one of those guys in a flower. But I'd I'd much rather see an Eggman flower. But I guess also this game isn't like leaning into like more classic traditional sonic visuals anyway so nope which you know i guess i'm always sort of on on the uh, on the line because it's like you know sonic had a very distinct look in the 90s and they experimented with that in the 2000s and sonic doesn't have to i don't think sonic has to only look one way forever and ever until he dies but you know sometimes yes he does Oh, I know, but sometimes it just wanted to seem a little bit more Sonic-y, even if it's hard to quite define. Because, I mean, hey, it's a big green field. Sonic has lived on green fields all his life. But I guess, I don't know. Maybe it's because it just looks like PSO2, um, which isn't a Sonic game. Or it looks like Breath of the Wild isn't a Sonic game. What do you make of these uh, red squares when these enemies get defeated? Yeah, I don't like Many it. Hurt. I don't want Infinite to be here. I <laughs> Please tell me this is not Phantom Ruby shenanigans. I'd be so mad. I, I, yes. I'd hope not. I mean, maybe Sega is... I mean, it's not like Phantom Ruby squares. It's it's like some other square, right? Oh, okay. I think. That's what you're saying. I believe Yeah, you. like... I, I would be I would be shocked to find out that actually Infinite is inside this thing. Well, he's not because we see it. Explode. This thing specifically, or like like this thing, like the, I guess the any of it, man. You know, I, I would be like I would be completely shocked if they, they they decide to make this game an actual sequel to Forces. I'm like, no, they're 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 just they're just gonna take the same kind of visuals and just do something different with it. <laughs> Like, I think yeah, they'd want. I feels like they'd want to like obviously mate, have it have this uh, like stray stray as oh. far stray as further away from forces as they can. Something fell out of his foot. Yeah, there's like gears that come out, and I think you collect them. Whoa! Oh, so like in Mega Man, you collect. Are we going bonus. to? Are we going to craft? <laughs> oh God, I hope so. There's <laughs> Skull Trooper skin. He also kind of looks like a, a like a like a metal Palkia, mm. but <laughs> uh, yeah, who's that? that is gear, mm. a lot of yeah. I can't go by. Oh, oh, bye, <laughs> TJ. TJ's really excited for Sonic Frontiers. He can't wait to pre-order. He's going to get the digital deluxe edition. Oh man, I can't. I, I wonder <laughs> what the digital deluxe will contain. Like, will it just be extra these guys? A new costume classic sonic music to play while you explore the overworld goodbye t the j right. forever i really hope you i hope you i hope he saved his audio <laughs> yeah. oh he left left okay bye dj yeah he's no longer here he can't <laughs> he can't rebuttal anything so you know Met he can't bring our this positive squad right. down you know metropolis <laughs> zone is definitely not squad. underwater <laughs> <laughs> the sonic defense squad it, uh, i mean i guess i'm not being super positive about it I, I mean, I, I'd hope for the best, but this footage does not instill me with the greatest um, confidence. It just. I think you and I are in similar boats. Yeah. Yeah. Um. I also think it's weird that these clips are split up. Like, so we this is like thirteen minutes of gameplay, but I also feel like we don't see anything in it. <laughs> you know. I mean, there's wall running. Well, what more do you oh, want? Yeah. Look at that. I'm all. All right. I'm also gonna say this. This might be controversial. I, uh -oh. I just, I, I'm, I'm, None I'm done with grind rails. I don't want Sonic to grind on a rail ever again. Oh, I've got some bad news for you about this <laughs> game, David. <laughs> like it, it was. They've been here since 2001, David. They're here to yeah. stay. Um, doesn't mean I have to like it. it... <laughs> yes, you oh, do. You're right, I do love. It. See, the thing about loving something is not. Not disliking any of oh. it. Oh, you know, it's just like <laughs> it makes sense in certain places, but man, when you have a level that's just rails over nothing, like that, I don't like that. Uh, rails in City Escape made sense to me, um, and there are, I guess, moments in here where rails could make sense, but there's just, I'm sure that some of those rails are just over nothing. Like it'll, it's over water, 
and water will just instantly kill you because Sonic can't swim, so that means if he's in half an inch of water, he will immediately die. Uh, Unless he lands and immediately starts running and you can climb your way back up there and try it again. Right, huh? Which would be neat. Huh? Uh, there, there's, there's the possibility. I, I guess I've never been 100% into the idea <laughs> of open world Sonic either. Like, No, me either. Sonic, because mm. it, it's a platformer, like, it, you know... I mean, it doesn't. It doesn't necessarily just have to be a straight line A to B. You can play with the idea. I mean, uh, Super Mario Odyssey has like. I mean, I guess you could describe like a level in there as sort of an open world. Hey, you're you're jumping around and dicking about, but it's it. But that's not like Breath of the Wild either. Breath of the Wild is its own thing. Um, and I think I think Sonic like there could be moments that look open worldy like you know i've talked about oh man a, a sonic adventure remake where everything flows together seamlessly would be neat but it would still have like it would have the illusion of open world but it would still have like specific zones and levels to go through if everything is just super open wide like here i don't know it's like where is sonic meant to go mm -hmm. I guess we got a counterweight because mm -hmm. if you go by the years of 4chan leaks, they're um, continually proving to be correct. Uh -huh. There are more structured levels that you can access. That's right. Cyberspace levels. The, we haven't even seen the whole game. <laughs> that is true. We haven't. We've seen half an island. Um, now, that said, if you start getting cynical, and maybe you should, depending on your perspective, uh -huh. and going like, oh, those are probably just going to be designed more like Sonic Forces. Yeah. Well, I uh, mean. Right. Those are okay, I guess. We we don't know who, <laughs> uh, like we don't know who's designing these levels, but we do know who the director is, and the director of this game is Takao Miyoshi, which may or may not be pronounced right. And who? Uh, Miyoshi, isn't that his name? Am I wrong? Are you thinking of Mario Kishimoto? And you're right. Edit that name out. The That's director wrong. of Kino, Sonic, and the Black Knight. I am looking at a different tab. I was just looking at a tab behind me, and I saw it, and I'm like, oh, that's his name, Miyoshi. Miyoshi <laughs> is not... Miyoshi's the guy. <laughs> he worked on Sonic Adventure, not this game. I'm sorry. It's... Yeah, what's his name? Tio Monomo. <laughs> what, what? Hey, wait a minute. Uh, say it again. What's his name? Morio Kishimoto. Morio Kishimoto. Kishimoto. Man. I just wanted to point out real quick, I haven't seen anyone really mention uh, it. The There's this little dude here. That's true. Just a little it's Korok. He's just a little guy. And you can see him slowly turn and look up for a few frames here. And yeah. I think he's like a little NPC dude, and I want to see what his deal is. But he's yeah. kind of like turning out. He's like, up, oh, and then he's gone. There's big ones and small ones. Um, there were small ones hanging next to that that thing right there. Oh, we're about yeah. to see some small ones. Are they yeah, hanging they're out over there. there. Are they the new channel? Um, Will they have a garden? A rock garden? Oh. Right. Morio Kishimoto. There they are. He directed Forces. He directed Lost World. He did direct Colors. Colors. Uh, but he was also the lead game designer of Secret Rings and Black Knight. And he's yeah. also a... So this is a good hand. Yes. He's... I mean, there are people who like Black Knight, but I feel like it's because of Whoa. the story, not because of the game. Uh, yeah. So, he has an interesting track record. Um, that interesting track record being, I feel like most people don't like his games <laughs> yet. The track record he has that scares me is, um, if I can find just like a really great example around here, is like when I think of a lot of his games, I think of like narrow blocky pathways that don't really have a lot of variants or interesting things to them. And then I look at this and I'm like, oh, this looks a lot kind of like that just floating over nothing <laughs> right this, this looks a little like colors and forces design huh i was hoping we could maybe be a little past that by now because my hope we have all these things floating in the sky when i heard there was an open world sonic i was like oh the world is the sonic level right i was really excited to see that and you get like little glimpses of it like oh there's some rails shooting you around but it kind of feels like the focus is going to be unlocking all these weird floating sky elements and then when you see them it's just kind of like yep yeah, there's the floating platform that yeah there's no paths or anything it's just like can you get through this correctly okay i mean that's kind of fun i enjoyed unleashed right but that was also 14 years ago <laughs> right it, it doesn't and it, when it was juxtaposed against like here's this cool new thing i'm like what if that was designed 
more like a Sonic level. That'd be... Yeah. yeah. That is, uh... Yeah, this, it, it, cause... Like, I kind of want to look at that and be like, it'd be cool if you could, like, spin dash, jump off, and get to with that stuff at least, mm -hmm. but it kind of feels like they want you to go somewhere over here and spring up to it. When I've looked at the open world fan games, I, I was always cynical of them because I was like, well, what do you do? When I look at this <laughs> and I see things that you can actually do. So, I don't know. I've, I, I like this more than the fan game stuff I've seen. And I, I know mm. that's a hot take. People are going <laughs> to not... They are not going to like that, but I don't care. I've never cared much for the... This Sonic fan did it better than Sonic Team did with the weird open world that's kind of aimless. Now I'm with yeah. you on that. Yeah. I played most of them and I was like, eh, all right, yeah. There's something that could be here, but it's not here for me right now. Oh yeah, there's boost in this game. As you can see, the person playing it pressed the boost button every three seconds, and then apparently let's go. It's like a, sp I think it's a spurt. Right. Like you, you mm -hmm. press it and you get like four seconds. Right. I, well, there is also, I mean, if, we, if we're talking about leaks, because I don't think they've confirmed it. You know, the, some of the leaks said, oh hey, you know, there's gonna be like what skill uh level up thingamabob skill tree oh, yeah. so it could be oh yeah the boost is weak but once everything's leveled up then your boost will go forever won't you love that mm. give it a give give your boost a kiss um yeah because like some of us are like oh there's no spin dash it could be like one of the playtesters said that the spin cycle was an unlockable move actually like you don't start with that even and it kind of seems like a core gameplay element considering some of this stuff right well, so. this is the first island so and we, we're seeing him use it on the first island so we're probably gonna get it real quick yeah yeah so like what i was yeah more like going getting as like there's probably a lot right i mean hopefully a lot he could do that we just don't even know yeah, about like look at those interesting signs with the question mark um <laughs> yeah right right the story might start off with sonic going Man, I heard Amy uh, invited me over to a picnic. She said it's somewhere around here. Starfall Islands? I've never gone. Whoa, where's everyone? There's nothing in this field. And then he hears Amy and he, she's like, Sonic, um, we've all been turned into computer data, I guess. And he's like, whoa, even all my level uh, design? He's like, yeah, all the level <laughs> designs in here in the computer. Could you please unlock it all? He's like, man. Also, I maybe have amnesia. <laughs> Like, whoa, I can't believe it. Um, Something I haven't seen a lot of people point out either. Uh, the spring over here. Yeah. So you can go down uh -huh. here and do something. So yeah. maybe something just pops in there's here also makes one, this make sense. There's also one off to the left right there, yeah. Yeah, there he is. Oh. That must be how you get back up. Right. It feels like there should be something in this. There might be later. Maybe you fight a big well, right cyber above, summon. Uh, the, the inverted pyramid's right above that. Oh. Well, there you um, go. Yeah. So it's maybe the pyramid raises up or maybe it crashes down. Maybe. Uh, either or. Man, there was an inverted pyramid in, in Super Mario Odyssey. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> you know, a lot oh, of things no. from very recent Nintendo games are in this game. That's true. Um, right. Right. There, mm. there's, there's a bit of Odyssey. There's a bit of Breath of the Wild. There's a bit of of uh, dread. Bowser's Fury. Uh, oh, oh, right. Yeah. Dread. Yep. <laughs> Just a bit of dread. Some Red Dead Redemption Two when he starts getting because animals. The joke is that I'm feeling <laughs> dread about the game. The joke. Wow. I thought you were talking about the enemies, but okay. oh yeah, I mean that works. You know what gives me reverse dread? I like that when you run toward this rock cliff, you kind of just seamlessly start running up it. I think yeah, that's pretty good. neat. That might be fun. Yeah. There could be situations where I like doing that. That gives me some hope. Right. There, there is, there is. That's the hopium. Right, there is footage in the other, the other one where Sonic starts to run up a hill and like immediately slows down, in in an awkward. <laughs> <laughs> You're a typical Sonic retro complainer. That's right. David. That's right. I'm complaining. I don't know. I think I need to see more of this thing. I, I've looked at all this and I'm like, man, I don't really feel like a lot. I wish I was feeling something. I was looking forward to this, honestly. Like, maybe not so much at first, but as time went on, I was like, you know, this could actually be like a really cool game. And like, eh, I can like sort of see how it could get there, uh, but... It, it doesn't feel like a game that's supposed to come out in five months or six months. Yeah, you know? If you guys <laughs> don't like this, uh, be prepared for more, because this is supposed to be the next decade of Sonic games. Uh, is this that's style. True. Uh, it's the next decade, well, and 
if by that they mean this is the only game you're getting in the next decade, then sure. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, man. I just... I, I, I just am staring at this thing. This ball. I don't know. Hey, you know, what I've not heard anyone talk about so what? far is that triangles play a very big theme in this game. Uh, the springs don't have stars anymore. They've got triangles. The towers are triangular prisms. Uh, there's big triangle huts everywhere. There's a lot of triangles in this game. Some triangle monuments. Oh, one right there. There's one right oh. there. The springs have triangles on them. You may have said that, but I was so busy trying to get to this frame. So do the balloons. <laughs> There's triangles everywhere in this damn game. Does that mean it's connected mm. to Palm Tree Panic? <laughs> yes. It's the Triforce. <laughs> oh. It's Zelda oh. again. Tri I get it. Right. Mm. It is the sequel to Lost World DLC. Does that say good up there? That... Did those rel, rel spell out good? Good. <laughs> See, the, guy, the game's gonna be good, guys. The game's Look, gonna right be there. good, guys! Oh. Unless you're standing over there, in which case it's right. Duke. Maybe, maybe, you know, as you play, more rails get unlocked, and then at the end, when you win, the camera zooms all the way out, and you see that it's spelling out a message. Uh, Thank you so much for to play my yeah. game! Maybe the message is different depending on the mm. console you're playing it on. So, so on... On the Switch, it will be uh, Mario, <laughs> and then on the Xbox, it'll be uh, Master Chief, star of Halo, the TV series. I want oh. the credits to be written in cursive, and Sonic grinds through every single letter. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's what they spent the last six months doing. <laughs> I wonder what's up with that. It's a very a oddly shaped rail. Yeah. I'm... How many people do you think have talked about Sonic's humongous hitbox in this game? Oh, not enough. Because he pick he picks up things from like two and a half Sonics away. Hmm. Didn't think about that. He does. Yeah. And he then does. there's like this if you rock rewind thing to the purple up. coin part, that's the most obvious. Oh man. Yeah, go to the purple coins. I love those eyes. Maybe a little further back. Oh no, there they are. Um, it's the last one that he gets. Yeah, slow it down. Okay, so this is definitely Switch for oh. oh. <laughs> It's the very last one that he gets. See, he doesn't even touch <laughs> it! Oh, he's like so far away. He probably he couldn't even touch it with his arm if he reached out. Yeah. Oh, here we go. We're doing it. Oh. Oh, you're gonna frame by frame. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, and oh, it, there. And there it is. Wow. Yep. Sonic, <laughs> and when he's when he's running past some rocks, he knocks them over without even touching them, and it's oh. like, yeah, yeah, that's the one I was looking for because it makes me chuckle. That one I like. I can rationalize that as like a fun like. Wind. Oh man, he's just so much. Right, he's so fast. Power around him. There it is. Yeah. Oh, wait, which, which could be like that's fine. Purple coin, not so much. Nah, it's the hitbox. Punk. <laughs> well, Sonic is big. <laughs> <laughs> he sure is, buddy. He's a big I'm not boy. big enough, judging by Twitter today. Uh, he's pretty uh, big. Sonic, he's so tall. <laughs> the thing that gets Where me... The hearts? I, what do you think the hearts are? Collectibles. But, and you... And you... Uh -huh. Open your heart! Oh. Man. What were you going to say? I'm sorry that this is just us looking at this and going, Why is this this way? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, these dash pads... Boom, boom, spring? Why can't you just jump over the... <laughs> it's, it's possible at the end of that spring there was a heart that was already collected. Oh, uh, yeah. That's my, that's my idea. Oh. Okay. Because I, that spring right there, that. the spring over there uh, leads to a heart. See? There's one up there. Oh, okay. Nope, I like that. We're going to go okay. with that. <laughs> Tonic's in a wheel. He's oh, there's even a little rock dude. Way back there, chilling out. Yeah, he's having fun. Are they fun. the new Chow? Are is are they called Chow? Chow Chow? Mini Chow, Rock Chow, Stone Chow. See, I feel like if the Chow were in this, we would have known by now because that feels like such easy, good public, good good publicity. So it, it, that that's that's why I'm like, like, why would you hide 
something like that when you're really struggling mm. when when you're really struggling to find something that like oh people will immediately just snatch like you know like sega knows at this at least the people who people who work at sega know that people would drop everything for something chow related so if they're like hey shouldn't you show off the chow if people are getting nervous because you know, no matter how nervous I, I like i would be like if, if no matter how nervous people are of this gameplay if they came out and said oh yeah tower in this game people would drop everything and be like actually no that, that doesn't bear like now i'm super excited honestly they would yeah sounds like a great twitter reveal for august as we're getting near and everyone's <laughs> doom and gloom and they're like hey yeah look at these shiny things though huh they dangle them in front of your face yeah it's like between that and like the story is probably going to be the thing that turns a lot of people like back into this game's corner right like if the story looks cool and like oh man the guy you've wanted to write sonic games forever is writing this one look at this story oh, yeah probably. that is very true there he also. is <clears throat> ian flynn he's come back he's he's he he wrote yeah. everything he wrote the script to the story he wrote the scripts in the engine uh me you lie <laughs> not totally true you don't know that it's, i i think he he programmed the whole thing His himself as well um Holy shit, Ian! Yeah, call so me. It's, it's his Eggman symbol there. Do these graphics look like a uh, uh, mid PS4 generation? Uh, sort of. Yeah, I like not not even late generation. Kinda, yeah. I mean, I, 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 I do think it look. I, I think it looks good, like overall. But it's like, yeah, like it's not. It's not like, oh man, this is like. PS5 mind blowing or no. ratchet and clank uh, rift apart no. levels. It's just like, oh yeah, it looks it looks good. Not to be the guy that blames the Switch, but if they didn't have to build this for the Switch also, it might look a little better. People are <laughs> people are uh theorizing that the Switch version will be cloud version. Mm. That'd make more sense to me than trying to imagine this on the Switch. Yep. Could be. Uh, you don't want to do <laughs> we'll this? actually make Look at this. You don't want to do this? <laughs> oh, here's the puzzle, okay? I, what if they were all What matching? if they all look the same? Good. That's a yeah. good puzzle. Is he even pushing the when, statue the whole time? Whenever a non-puzzle game has puzzles, they rarely get challenging enough to feel rewarding. Well, so that's You don't you don't want to do this? <laughs> I like puzzles, but I I want puzzles that challenge me. Oh, yeah. And you know, there's five-year-olds going to be playing this game, so you can't make them too hard. Yeah. I mean, if the puzzle, like, if the statue thing was, oh, I, it just opens a door. Well, dude. I feel like Sonic could probably just run around the door because he's fast and wild and crazy. He doesn't need to push the statue. Oh. They can make cyber some field. More. Can't get through it. They can make Sorry, some more Steven. challenging uh, puzzles, like, if they're just for strictly collectibles that you don't necessarily need. Like, hey, I've got enough jiggies to to fill fill in this puzzle. <laughs> this I don't need to collect that other jiggy. Outstanding, amazing. <sighs> oh, never mind. Uh, what I'm hoping we get soon, like what I just really need at this point, uh -huh. I just need like for me to be interested in this. I think aside from like a really flashy trailer, I just need someone working on this game to play it. And I need someone working on this game, or at least like a PR person, to give like a guided talk yep. over the game and say, okay, well, like, here's what you're kind of mostly trying to do. Here's the clearly delineated side stuff. This is what it's all in service of. Um, here's what you can expect to see eventually with the combat and just kind of be like, oh, okay, this is the video game. Because it's just so like out of context without knowing the proper aim of the game. To me, this just looks boring. And this is just like, oh, how many times am I going to fight this enemy and do this throughout this like open world, probably longer game, right? And like, if I knew I had a better idea of what it was building up to, or maybe if the, the story hook was there, so I knew what the story was going to be, I'd be like, oh, okay, well, I want to do this stuff because I want to see the story. Something, you know? I just need someone to sit me down like I'm six and say, stop complaining, you big internet Sonic baby. Here's the video game. And I'd be like, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> if Frontiers is all June long, uh, I think they're milking it. They're stretching it out because we've already gotten two I, 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 I videos. Can't, I can't. 
I can't tell if they're milking it or they're being like, let, let, let's let's they're be like, okay, put something out there, see the response, and then be like, okay, damage control, put out something else, see the response. Damn, just they have damage control for everything prepared, and just there's keep, no yeah. damage control so far, right? Um, the, it's just damage how you at want this to look point, at it. <laughs> right? Because because if, if Sega's like, let's put this footage out and see what people think. Um, do that if the game comes out a, a year and a half from now, not in five months. <laughs> Because well, the, what we're seeing uh, here now was recorded on Wednesday, the day the first footage went out. Because you know we had to look through the metadata of the files because someone somehow got the watermark list version going around, mm -hmm. and there are file names referring to June first, and the others are like May eleventh. So I don't know if that means the reception was bad, and they're like, "Oh shit, we got to show off this thing, uh, right? This the thing." <laughs> um. <laughs> If the first video had this thing, no one would have said a bad word. I mean, this at least looks like, you know. I like when he falls off and, and then the footage <laughs> changes. Or did you rewind? Uh, he does the face yeah. plant. They're showing it off. It's a deep cut for the fans. Oh. I, I like that there are options for this. I like that it theoretically climbing up the arms of these things will eventually be like more challenging, but from what we see here, both are the same. I mean, this is like first, you know, island stuff. Like, I wish he was stomping around a bit or something, but you know, maybe it gets there. What if this is just a poor, yeah. innocent creature and Sonic has just decided he must die? You know? <laughs> so, yeah, so it's... literally Shadow of the Colossus then. <laughs> <laughs> uh, a little bit? Yeah. 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 They're guardians. Sonic will just pull out the Black Knight quote and be like, well, I guess I have to be the villain again. Haha, <laughs> whoa! They're just doing their job. Whoa! Yeah. Sonic's killing them. They're just chilling on this island, and now Sonic is here killing them. He didn't have to be here. He could run away. Uh, also, if I'm fighting something, and that something uh, kills two of my three arms, maybe I won't keep fighting it. Maybe I'll walk away. <laughs> no, this time for sure. <laughs> I would like... David and Chris's opinion on this following statement. People Hi. people didn't like uh, SA1's graphics or theme when it came out. They were like, what? Real world stuff? Rah! And now that game's a gem and people love it. Do you think the same thing might happen here? <laughs> it is definitely... No matter how much this game... No matter how this game turns out, in five years, people are going to love it. Yeah, I don't want to put Jay's Reviews on blast, because Jay's Reviews seems like a nice person. But Jay's Reviews is the one that put up the um, the very long, like, defense of Sonic 06 within the last year. Mm -hmm. Like, we're getting to the point where, like, now even 06 has people come out being like, Hey, you know what? There's stuff about it I like. You know, there's stuff about it I enjoy. And if there's anything the internet has taught me, even if this is the most hated game when it comes out, a few years later, I'll see four pictures of this game on Twitter every other day and people being like, Sonic Frontiers really is the most underrated game, though, for real, for real. Yeah, and yeah. Well, I, I, I think, I think that there's a difference between being like, oh, this thing has things that I really like about it versus this game, this versus this thing has absolutely nothing wrong about it. And I think I think that I think that, that that's the difference. That's a lot of people I were that I call the Sonic Defense Squad, uh, like but like how like confuse it. It's like. You can't like they. You can't say something is like you. If if you see something as flawed but you like it, it's like oh, it can't be flawed. I like it. So you gotta like, <laughs> gotta do a lot of like jumping over hoops in order to be in order to explain why it isn't flawed. When it's like <laughs> no, you it, it you there might be some things that you don't like that you think are problems with it, but those things that you like about it, like though they still that like that that's still fine. Which is why the thing of like, yeah. like where I was like when forces came out, I was like oh hey like. Well, the forces has a lot of issues about it, but it has some things I enjoyed. So I'm like, yeah, I'm whatever with forces. And now we've got to the point where it's like, oh, forces, good things being like now forces is like excellent. And everybody who's like shitting on it now is only shitting on it for clout. And now it's like, eh, I don't know oh. what oh. eh, you think. I think you're striking. <laughs> I'm glad I'm not in those circles. You're, you're reaching. <laughs> you're reaching a lot there. And that's why this, yeah. that was why like, like my, my first reaction to this, like like when the, like the first gameplay thing came out, I'm like, the Sonic Doom posters and the Sonic Defense Squad are both equally terrible because it's just yeah. it's the two extremes of like people getting very very anxious over any like minor criticism about Sonic and then the people who are just like looking yeah, again looking for things just to be overly mad about when it's like yeah there's not 
like too much like to uh really truly like again like doom and like spout like the worst thing uh like just be, be like oh this will be the worst thing imaginable yeah I've, it's just the internet now right like i've already seen people be like oh well this is gonna be worse than those six and rise of lyric like it's gonna be boring and that's gonna be more damning than it being just you know bad and i was like what like i don't know like i'm not inspired or enthused by this but like especially in the first playthrough i'm like you know it'll probably be at least fun to poke at and see what the hell they made right like i'm i mean we're on this channel we're probably all gonna play it no matter what yeah, right? I'm, I'm, but... I'm, 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 I'm getting it i'm getting it right at the beginning <laughs> right. i have no shit yeah, i'm like... being like oh I'm, I'm still i'm like i'm still super interested and i'd be like oh yeah i want to play this i want to see how this turns it's more so being like i really want this to turn out good because i think this is a genuinely great idea it's just yeah we just mm -hmm. haven't seen like enough exact good contacts to be like okay i'm well i'm willing to wait and see that contact and then if it turns out great then it's like yes if it turns out to be mixed turn out to be mixed where it's like oh there's some good and there's some bad then it'll be like eh, at least there's still some good like i mean i i, I kylie i mean considering even i'm like yeah horses had like moments that i enjoyed about it like i'm pretty sure there's gonna be stuff about it i enjoy just how much <laughs> how much is in there is that that's all i gotta wait yeah what if sonic team just tried to make a sonic game oh well hey i got something for you um ign's running coverage on this new game uh-huh it's called Sonic Frontiers. Oh. Take a look. See? Springs. Rails? They, Springs? <laughs> huh? David, they did that in 2017. We didn't like oh, it. Oh, uh, that wasn't... Uh, no, I wasn't one. That's all. And they did it again in 2017, but then they were like, eh, no more of that. Oh, right. That one was. <laughs> I don't know. It just... I wouldn't... It... Uh, it well, you know, it always My feels hope. like... Oh, never mind. Go on. No, oh, sorry. Just my grand statement, then I'll let you continue. Uh -huh. My hope is that even if this comes out, it's kind of whatever. I hope... I want to see them just stick to it and be like, alright, well, we're going to make it better. We're not going to abandon it and go back to the boost formula and make another yeah. meh game. Or we're going to try something else and have it kind of not work. Like, I just want to see them build a foundation, stick with it, and say, you know what? It's not for everyone, but we're going to make it better for those who liked it, and go with it. And even if it's not for me, I'm at the point where I'm like, I just want to see them actually build on something and i you could look at this and be like oh well they're putting the forces kind of gameplay into a larger world like in a way they're building on it right but more specifically like i want to see them flesh out the sonic open world idea even if yeah. it winds up being something i don't ever care about i just want to actually see them stick with it for once yeah when you make a new engine um you, you spend a lot of time making that engine uh if your first game isn't so good reuse the engine and just try again right. Yeah, because then you can just yeah, it costs. With it. <laughs> yeah, all you, at that point, all you have to do is just design different terrain. You know, you don't have to make a whole new engine again. So, mm -hmm. what if what if they made this game in the Sonic One engine? <laughs> well, it probably wouldn't well, work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, see, I want an open world 3D blast game. That's what I oh, want. Man, let's go. I will give someone a box of pop darts <laughs> if, after this game comes out, they recreate it in its entirety in 3D Blast. <laughs> Do you think the Havoc engine is back? Because it looks havoc -y when mm. you break stuff. Uh, mm. That was a I mean, note. you know. I don't know why I wrote that down. It's possible. <laughs> it does kind of look like it, doesn't it? A little bit. And now that you say that, this is not a Havoc thing. But I'm like, man, that box looks a lot like an 06 box. And when I think of 06, I think of Havoc. <laughs> <laughs> so maybe this is using the Havoc engine. And then also there's a box from 06. Oh man, maybe maybe we'll see some of the uh, NPCs from 06. Yeah, the way that stuff falls apart. It, it makes me think of Unleashed. Like it looks it looks like when, 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 you, yeah. when you smack like mm. you smack boxes with the yeah. Werehog and they, they yeah. Hurt. Whoa, go back. Uh oh. And go through it like frame by frame. Keep going. What's that green green thing? Oh, that there? thing. What's that thing there? Ooh. You ask? Yeah. What's Ooh. that? Is it a chaos emerald? It's a tube of slime. Whoa. What is that it's thing? Slimer from the real Ghostbusters. It's Mewtwo. I think I saw that in TMNT two the other week. <laughs> just noticed that. I've watched this thing twenty times, and I just noticed that. 
Oh, isn't there footage of a Chaos Emerald in... Oh, I was watching Sam Procrastinate's It's reaction. really blurred. I saw that yeah, too. Yeah, like yeah. it's... And he was mentioning It's something. diamond shaped. So it kind of... I don't remember. Was it in this or was it in the 30 seconds of... I want to say it was in this one. I was watching him react to the combat stuff, so I think it's in the water section off... Oh, yeah. Okay. This thing over on the right. Uh -huh. Right there. Yeah, that thing. That specific thing with the white ball around it. I've seen some people think that's the red chaos emerald. There's a better angle of it somewhere. I think it's not here. Right. It might it might hmm. be the, the initial 30 second tease that was on Twitter. I could I could be wrong. Alright, IGN, don't have anything untoward in your video page. Oh no. <laughs> look at that angry face. Oh man, look at Paleontologist reacts to Jurassic World dinosaurs, bro. Uh, oh my god, what? Well, it's so much. How yeah. do they do this? Like the anti FTCR. We're only two days in. Really three Oh <laughs> This is two days the worth of videos? Machine. Okay. Oh my god, I'm sorry if it's right in front of me. It is. Wait, how we can bump Diablo? We yeah, you have to you, okay, you, you, you have to control F Sonic. That's right. how you get it. Are, are the thirty oh seconds Lord. on here even? What if are you talking about down? David? Are you talking about the December video? No, no, no. The 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 video that like was on Twitter the day before. The oh first, yeah, that. Uh, so I guess it was on May thirty first. Let's collab with some other tubers. Let's see if we can find it. Uh. Uh. uh um. Uh, oh, go to go to Sonic oh, Twitter. Hmm. Yeah, it was on their Twitter, I think. If you just go to twitter.com slash Sonic the Hedgehog. Mm, Sonic underscore Hedgehog. Oh, three days ago. That would be it. You were looking at it. Oh. Yeah, the top one. Three, yeah. Oh, hey. All right. I'm trusting you guys. I don't know what we're okay. doing. Okay. I'm trusting David. I on feel this. like oh. it, was, right, David. it was in here. I could be. Oh. That right there. Oh, yeah, there yeah. it is. Holy shit, oh. David. Good ah, job. I remember. <laughs> He's so serious. Look at him. Is there a chaos do, 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 do. Do, do. Yeah. All right, you gotta pause it and do the frame by frame. I was gonna say, do you think he sees his nose when he runs? <laughs> I hope. Yeah, there it is. It's oh, something. That. There's something that's, floating. Yeah, there. and it, that's like a yellow version of what we saw. Yeah. yeah. So you, you get a little closer. It kinda, kinda, kinda. Hmm. Course, it's very blurry. <laughs> so, David, yeah. that monument type thing right there, there are two of those on this island that I've seen so far. Mm, well, if there's only four islands, then there's seven Chaos Emeralds. Yeah. Of course, if it is right two, there, two, 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 man, one. Sonic sure doesn't care. <laughs> I would theorize you know how these are all pointing mm -hmm. up, and we have these <gasps> level elements around them? You probably have to do the level, and then these things like fall or like kind of move out right like they fall down so to speak and they open up and then you can get in i bet there's like a force field or something preventing you from going in and you like deactivate the barrier and then grab it i was thinking they start to glow and you enter them and they shoot you off into a different like oh. uh, cyber world where you do the, those levels that are uh rumored i like your idea more that sounds more fun yeah, like, like, look, 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 looking at your look, looking at that that like thirty second trailer, it's clear that they pretty. It, it feels like like these two like these footage was just the B roll, and then they then then they 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 snapped like the little sections into that thirty second trailer. So it's basically mm -hmm. just like okay, this is the B roll footage that they then used for that trailer. So it's like you can see moments of being like, oh yeah, these moments like on their own when like edited together like look nice, but then when you're just kind of using it like in a in a world where you're just basically collecting that footage to use. In the trailer, it doesn't, yeah, it doesn't look as uh, nice. Nice. Did we already mention? Oh yeah, it's glowing right there. Ooh. Did we already mention yeah. that the music in these in both of these videos are added in yes, post? Yes, you, you mentioned that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 sure yeah, yeah. Because I said that they sounded very Kingdom Hearts. Yeah. <laughs> and is and is is is, is, is Otani handling the music for this? Because then I read that it said Sonoy was also doing music. Well, yeah. I mean, um, you can. Um, you have both of them. <laughs> unless it's just both of them doing it. Right. Well, every Sonic game has had more than one composer. Well, there's usually one main composer, and then they have, like, the other ones. Let's, that's. Yeah. That'd what, be the, the sound director? Yeah. Yep, yeah. The sound director that, is what I was going to Yeah, think. that's what I mean. Like, which one's the sound director? 
I think Otani is sound director because he he tweeted about how how much effort went into just doing like sound effects and stuff. Mm. Look, they, look, they, 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 there was physics going up that hill because Sonic slowed down. Uh, yeah, but yeah, he's approaching the situation. You know, it's not like it's not like he doesn't know what's up. He's like, oh, there's enemies nearby. I can hear their cyber field. Oh, but he, I mean, I better slow down. He sure does Whoop. slow down. Like, I'm just replaying oh, this because I know David yeah, hates it. It's, uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's not that bad. It's a little, it's a little bad. bad. We don't have the context for the control. Like, he might have let up on the thing, right? I'm yeah. not trying to be like Mr. Copium out here, but, you know, we don't know what's up I, with the... I, yeah, we don't I, know. I, I just know you don't like it, and that makes me <laughs> trouble. We don't know. <laughs> it's just like a little electric zap. Like, what's that? Like a sense? Are they sensing? I think that's a... This enemy's going to shoot something at you kind of warning. Like, he's he's lining it up. Or, like, that's... He, he's going to attack. Oh. Uh. Which is good, because I was kind of hoping there was a little more oh. telegraphing, watching some of this footage. Yeah. It's like, I think there's like a little whirring noise you hear when it comes up, so that's kind of like your, oh, I better get out of the way. Kinda They're really tell. bad at rock, paper, scissors, because they can only use scissors. <laughs> <laughs> I like when he does the nights in the dreams loop around all the enemies here, and then they all go up in the air. I think that's pretty cool. Launcher, then you go in and whoop them. Oh, I didn't even think about knights. Yeah. It, it is a bit knightsy. Um, Yuji hates this game. <laughs> He's using more than one button? <sighs> <laughs> it's just a, the neat little loop. I like the loop. I mean, I like the loop. They fly up, and then Sonic hits them, and they're gone. And I guess that's fine, but... Um, you know, if it was more looping and then single hits instead of looping, and then you gotta do 30 hits... You know, some of these enemies looks like they, they take about 12 years to defeat. Um, which, <laughs> if there is a level up system, it might. <laughs> he just falls on his face. Uh, it might, it might, it might, you know, become quicker. Like in Sonic Heroes, you yeah. gotta level up three times before you can break everything in one hit. Until then, you have. Yeah, gotta grab the power orbs. Yeah, yeah. Which, which are canon. Yeah. They're, they're part of the IDW. Sonic shouts, level up! He does. Level up! <laughs> I wanna look at the structure a little more. Huh. That's probably something, obviously. There but. are there are two of those. There's one here and there's one at the top of the waterfall, or like right next to the waterfall. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, in that little dip area. Mm -hmm. You can see all that on my map. Ooh. Ah. So far I've seen three uh there's one over there, yep. Yeah. There it is. Um I've seen three uh, what are the things of sand that you turn over and it helps you tell time hourglasses i've seen three of those oh yeah those are around two yeah um it's like one around that has to be there. there yep yeah those have to be time trial things right i don't know what else oh would yeah be. i would think so things pop up and you have to do it in a certain amount of time yeah 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 There are yeah. things to do in this game, guys. I'm telling you, it's going to be <laughs> game of the it's, year. It's going to look good eventually. You just got to wait. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know. We probably exhausted what we have to say based on yeah, this, right? I think it I'm does done. feel like, yeah. oh man, but like we've we've done hour and a half on 14 seconds of footage. This is 13 minutes. <laughs> we, it's just nothing, guys. What are you doing? Clear your schedules. <laughs> <laughs> we we got to go with the long haul. I, oh I'm well. Like, we we, yeah. we did an hour and a half off of, off of 14 seconds because it was a video full of speculation. Like, if you want to speculate about the origin of the Chaos Emeralds is apparently supposed to be in this game, that pisses me off. I don't want to know the origin of them. Yeah. I found them in, in Jersey. <laughs> well, that would make me happy, but you know. I hope that in November 2022, date pending if it doesn't get delayed or whatever, mm -hmm. I hope I look back at this video and I'm like, you silly goose, you should have just waited, you dumbass. This game's good. You silly, silly boy. I want to be wrong, I want to like it. I hope it's better than what they're showing. I just wish they had planned their showing a little better. <laughs> yep. They were. Stefan's excited for this. Yeah, I want to play. I'd be like, it's Sonic. I like Sonic. Huh. I want to play more Sonic. Like, I wanted like a good, like a a full like i mean this is exactly what I want, like a full 3d sonic game without any of the bs of being like oh this is 3d asterisk like no this is full 3d like did like did uh, hmm. we, we have another we have another candidate for sonic adventure 3 here 
Right? Oh, <laughs> never, you know, that is a good point. I hadn't taken the time to actually be grateful. Like, you know, at least it's not another mostly 2D game. Even if Whoa. what's here is a little basic so far, at least it's not that. We haven't seen the cyber levels yet, Chris. Oh, no. Mm. No, no. <laughs> the cyber levels are exclusively 2D. And then you find out it's 70% <laughs> of the game. <laughs> <laughs> what, oh man, what if the overworld really is like two and a half hours worth of stuff? <laughs> uh, uh, sounds fun. But what if it's just two and a half hours? You know, this? you know, I, I, I take fun. a Sonic game, I want to replay over a, a grueling Sonic game where I'm like, I never want to replay this ever again. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> no! <laughs> a Sonic like, if this is just like, oh, this is a 20, 30 hour open world Sonic game. Oh god. <laughs> no, Jesus, that no. Like, I think at Breath of the Wild, I'm like, man, I'm I don't know when I'm ever going to want to replay that. I haven't even ended my first playthrough because I don't want it to end. But the idea of starting over, oh. <laughs> Maybe it's uh, anyway. Sonic, Sonic Frontiers. Frontiers. You know what I say? I say it's time to drink. Yep. Oh. Good, 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 good. David's about to start some theory crafting. Oh maybe. yeah. Well, I gotta okay. figure out where it takes place in the timeline, but since we don't have any information. Oh, that's true. That's true. <laughs> okay, I think that does it for us. Um, I guess if something more substantial comes out that makes us go one way or the other, maybe we'll talk again about it. But otherwise, that's probably it from us on this for a while. Hopefully, it's good. Oh, man, uh, can't wait till we let's play I it. <laughs> Yeah, that'll be fun to tackle. Okay, thanks for listening, everyone. Go complain about this game on Twitter. Bye! <laughs>